one question, of course, is, uh, is this the way it always is? That a few committed people are the ones who make things happen? We've designated these committed people as our founding fathers, as our revolutionary heroes. Um, so if that is the direction that we want to go, then would we want to measure their results by the standard that they have set? Now, I'm not entirely clear they believed they had been successful, and it's very interesting. Michael McDonald said they wanted to forget that war, that part of it. But the real question here is whether they created a form of statecraft, a political system that would avoid future conflagrations. That is, would they be able to document that a, that a republic was more likely to produce peace and social order and the good life than a monarchy or some other form?